Tonight, all clear. We had some showers earlier tonight in our southwest quadrant there of the Dayton area, south of uh, Interstate 70, west of Interstate 75, but no rain to be seen around the region tonight. We are tracking some thunderstorms up across the upper Great Lakes through Wisconsin, back towards Minneapolis, the Twin Cities there, St. Paul, and then extending out to Nebraska and South Dakota. Eventually, this will be dropping southeastward, so by the time we get to later tomorrow, especially tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, our rain chances will be going up with the approach of that front. High temperature today, warmer than yesterday, up to 87 after a low this morning, very comfortable at 63, 84 and 65, our normal highs and lows. And our live Doppler 2X weather network tonight as we check out the Phillips companies over in Beaver Creek, 76 degrees there. Uh, dew point has climbed into the low 70s again, so we're back to that muggy air. And the combination of the temperature, the dew point, the relative humidity there making it feel like 80 degrees and just a light southwest wind tonight across the region. Temperatures have warmed about 5 degrees from where they were at this time yesterday evening with those temperatures currently in the mid and upper 70, 77 degrees with mostly clear skies now in Dayton. South, southeast wind at 5 and there's that 67 dew point. So even out at Dayton International Airport feeling a little muggier up around that uh, 80 degree mark or so. Our weather checkers calling in tonight with those readings dropping off into the 70s in all areas. Bob Jacoby though just barely below the 80 degree mark at 79. Scott Biesker in Bradford 79 degrees as well. Nancy Davis in Pleasant Hill, 77 degrees tonight. Other temperatures around the region, David Wessler, New Paris at 74. Betty Shappy up close to that 80 degree mark, but a nice uh, 76 degree reading. Jim Robbins in the Beaver Creek area. And down south, finding uh, Centerville, Greg Shower there at 76 degrees. Pat Lee Cannon Trotwood, 78 tonight. Jim Allen in Middletown looking for a little bit of rain. And temperatures in the upper 70s, lots of upper 70s and low 80s still the southwest of us tonight. Not quite as muggy of an air mass over the eastern part of the state, so it has cooled off to about 70 in those locations. But as you can see here on our map, our dew point loop, the numbers have been increasing across eastern Ohio. So that push of the drier air over us yesterday, retreating now to the northeast, and here comes all that muggy air that was with us at the end of last week returning to the region. But not for long, because we have a front to the north of us tonight, and that front will be dropping southward. Uh, muggy air to the south of us this evening, and we have uh, warm front that is starting to lift to the north and northeast right through this region here and back to the northwest of us, a cool front that is dropping to the south and southeast. And that front is going to be playing a role in our weather as it moves southeastward, increasing that chance of rain by late tomorrow. Even tomorrow afternoon could be some pop-up thunderstorms in that sticky air mass, but a better chance into the evening and early tomorrow night as that front swings on by. Once the front gets south of us, though, it opens the door for some cooler, less humid air to return across the Great Lakes and bring us some nice weather for the Thursday and Friday time frame. Forecast tonight, mostly clear skies. will drop off to about 70 degrees with some light winds. Could even be a little patchy fog overnight. And then that chance for a thunderstorm tomorrow, mainly in the afternoon, upper 80s expected. And the temperatures warming quickly through the day, up near 80 by 10 a.m., low 80s at lunchtime, mid and upper 80s for the latter part of the day. And heading into the end of the week, there's that break in the humidity once again, 84 on Thursday, just a chance of an early morning shower or thunderstorm. Real nice day on Friday. And then Saturday and Sunday, Celtic Festival weekend coming up, 82 Saturday. There is a chance of a shower or thunderstorm and even a slight chance on Sunday, but it looks a little less now on the Sunday uh, period. And then into early next week, back into the upper 80s.